welcome to Neophyte.tv, the technology show for the not-so-geeky. My name is Tiffany Young. And I'm Ben Friedman, and we are still using our green screen system, although Ooh. I would like to point out for the record that Tiffany's shirt is not CGI. <laughs> and it looks like it with that little shiny kind of feel. CGI, this is fairly shiny. So it so. looks kind of alien. Alien. So it's sparkly. Shiny. And by the way, it's not Easter. <laughs> it is not. Oh, okay. That's smack against me, I guess. Anyway, today we're looking at the latest podcasting microphone from uh, Samson. Now, I think a year or so ago, we reviewed the first model of this, the C01U, which mm -hmm. was their first condenser microphone for uh, podcasting. You like it. I do. It has great quality. Yeah, and you can plug it into your computer, any mm -hmm. computer. Right, it doesn't need external power, nope. so you're good to go. And the, the sound quality really is, it's really nice, very it studio. It's very studio, and mm -hmm. you can get a really nice, rich sound mm -hmm. with these condenser mics. Now, yeah. what Samson has done is they've taken this to the next level uh, with this one, which is the CO3. Uh, and the big difference between the first ver version that you have and this one, and by the way, these are just directly, I've got them hooked up to a laptop here, just via USB. There's no other cables, yeah. no power supply, no brick. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> the big difference is that uh, this one has a switchable sound pattern, uh -huh. and that means that you can either have it unidirectional, where it just picks up one voice, or you can switch it to omnidirectional, where it'll pick up the whole studio, the whole room, or wherever you are. Let me try to illustrate that point. Right now I have it in omni mode, and what I'm going to do, turn this around, mm -hmm. and I'm going to um, uh, start recording. Okay, so now we're recording, and it's recording in omni mode. So. We, you should be able to hear Tiffany just as clearly as you hear me. Say something. Sound check, check one, check, check two. Check one, two. And it's picking check up from everywhere. Two. It's picking up now from the okay. whole studio. So this is great if you have a band or mm -hmm. an orchestra or you want to record a conference with people sitting around a table. It's picking up from every direction. Mm -hmm. I'm going to move this now. So you'll notice now it's now sitting between me and Tiffany. And say something. Uh, so... I like the design. It is nicely designed. They've changed the color scheme a bit. You'll yeah. see that the levels are pretty mm -hmm. constant between you and me right. right now. Now, if I change this now over to unidirectional, okay, you should now hear that it's much, it's loud for you but quiet for me. Right. The uh, You know what's really neat about this too is that, it, that? even the design, it's not that big. Not no, that bulky. It's small, and mm -hmm. you don't have to take it. Now, I don't know how well you're hearing me now because I'm on the back side, mm -hmm. and it's set to reject sounds from over here. So it's you shouldn't be picking up as much of the studio now, more just you. Right. Do you know if there's a big price difference between the old one and this one? Not a big difference. Yeah. It's about $20, $30 difference. Nice. Yeah, I'm going to switch it back mm -hmm. to Omni mode here. So now we're back to Omni mode. It should be picking us up pretty much evenly now mm -hmm. again. Um, you can buy this in two different ways. You can buy just the plain microphone, which comes with just this centerpiece here, or you can buy what we're looking at here, which is the podcasting kit, which comes with this suspension mount mm -hmm. that allows it to sort of float in the air without touching anything, which means it's not gonna pick up any noise from right. anything it's touching. And it comes with this little stand, and then it also comes with this little case. This is like a this is like a 007 case. Yeah, check this case out. I expect to see a lot of money in that briefcase. Look, it's got like all the little cutouts just so that you can transport. So if you're doing a lot of transporting, this podcast kit adds a bit. It's about 180, 190 bucks. But you get yeah. not only the case, you get the stand, you get the um, suspension mount mm -hmm. as well. So you get a lot of stuff. And we have it. we've tried many different microphones. Yeah, quite a few. And this is probably the best quality for the small size that that, that I found so far. I love that yeah, it's great. And you know what? The other thing that you can buy for this is now this doesn't come with a kit, but I saw this uh, as well. You can buy this. What is, oh, this that's is a cool. foamy windscreen. What you do is if you're ever shooting outside, outside. or if you're shooting close up where you're going to get a lot of peas and a lot of s sound, uh -huh. you take this. Like Sarah Palin. Sarah Palin. <laughs> she, does Sarah a lot of, she does a lot of. Uh, does she do that? Sounds. You throw this on like this, and uh, now it looks like a big ice cream cone. <laughs> But now you're going to be, you can get a lot closer to the mic. You can get it down here. And, Hi. So I Today if that would be better on for recording. Mystery Murder Peace Theater. Here, say something close. I wonder if that would be better for I'm recording music. Like if you were singing, for example. Yeah. You think that would be a better. Yeah, setup if you're sitting, like if, if, like if you want to sit, if you want to record nice and close, uh, which you do want to record for vocal, that's fine. Now you'll notice, by the way, I, I don't know if you saw over here, when I get close, I'm actually peaking the volume. That's a big karaoke mic. Yeah. There's actually a minus 10 switch. I can flick it down, minus 10, and now I can get a lot closer. It's actually lowering the volume of itself when I get close, so you're going to get a nice sound without um, 
you know, without getting too much, uh, without oh. peeking the mic. Here, try this getting is, This getting is close. so the Delilah so. Yeah, go ahead. Call in and tell me about your love letters. What I want to hear tonight is how are you feeling? What's on your mind? <laughs> <laughs> Talk to me, America. I'll flick it back over to regular mode. So now we're in regular mode again, and now it's, it's, it'll peak if I get too close. Very cool. Let me pull this off. Hope this isn't ah, too loud. And this is actually a great, you know, Halloween costume. <laughs> we get excited about stuff like this the because Halloween we use character. it all the time, you know, and when it works and it, you sound great, you don't have to do it 15 times. So I got to tell so you, worth it. this is the, uh, the Samson uh, CO3U USB microphone. Mm -hmm. Great quality. I give it a five out of five. And I, I, I can't dock it either. I, I've used it. It's great. The, um, five out of five for me as well. That's five out of mm. five. Tiffany, five out of five. Me, that's ten out of ten for the Samson CO3 totally U, agree. Oh USB my gosh. condenser mic. With now with the uh, multi pattern mm. that you can switch from one pattern to the other. It's nice and heavy too. And this is again the podcast mm. kit, which comes with the stand, or you can buy just the microphone itself if that's mm -hmm. all you want. Very nice. And that's all the time we have in the first section. We got another section coming up right behind it. So please stay tuned. Are you still lighting your videos the old-fashioned way? Heavy, fragile lighting fixtures? Hot lights that make your talent sweat? Gels and filters to match your colors? Time to take a look at the Xylite LED lighting system, the future of lighting today. Small, compact, and durable LED lights with high wattage output. Cool LED technology won't overheat your talent. And multicolor presets let you instantly choose from daylight, tungsten, or custom-colored illumination, fully dimmable at the touch of a button. And each Xylite comes with wireless networking built in for easy remote control. For more information, visit Xylite today at www.xylite.com. And we are back, and in the second Spotlight section today, we're talking about this fun little contraption which is not the marital aid that it looks like. <laughs> or, you know, that reminds me of the baby, um, baby Bjorn. Yeah. Bjorn. Bjorn. That's like a Star Bjorn? Trek reference. <laughs> uh, baby, baby Bjorn. Bjorn. Yes, I know exactly. For, what you're for your about. baby computers. Well, that's yeah. right. What is this, uh, you might ask? And it took uh, Tiffany a little while to figure it out, let me tell you. <laughs> and I probably wouldn't have known unless, uh, except that I got the press kit. Ah, very helpful. This is called connected desk. Now let me ask you, how many times have you ever been like running for a flight or, and you really want to use your computer or you're, you're walking around somewhere, there's no desk and you really need to use your computer and you thought, if only there was some way I could just have this floating desk out in front of me so I could walk, you know, maybe get a little exercise, walk around the block while I do my email. Oh. While I get my uh, taxes done. That's a recipe for disaster unless you're standing still. I mean, yeah. you're, first of all, well, first of all, you're gonna, you can't email. It's like driving and trying to text at the same time. Have you tried that on the new iPhone? Not a good idea. Yeah, not a good <laughs> you could idea. Use, like, you have to use both hands. So here's what this does. Is you take this and you, you put it on kind of like a reverse backpack. Okay. It goes on over your head. Squeeze. Like so. Here, I'll help you. Thank you. There, you go. Okay. there I see, I think you put it on like that first. Tilt it up and then put it on. Tilt then, it up and then put it on. Yeah, okay. I have my room. technique down. Okay. Okay, and then you'll notice now, let me turn sideways, I now have this uh, desk, and what I can do is I can now take my laptop computer, place it here, open it up, <laughs> and lo and behold, now I can work. In fact, I can do this while I'm doing the show. You take over, I'm just gonna do a little email check. Okay, so I guess the big concerns on that one would be, um, there ha there's no way to secure this, right? I mean, you're basically like, you know, I mean, there's, I see the little, bolt right here that you might know, help. You but probably put little rubber pads or something on the bottom. Well, or I, a strap. I mean, because if you drop this, a strap. I'm a little, after the whole iPhone incident, I'm a little worried about dropping things. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, so on, some just, sort of uh, strap, some sort of strap. I'll just check out YouTube here what you're talking about. Great. Yeah. And um, I'm not sure. Okay. So maybe the Mac people, right? Because they all walk around with um, their computers. They check you out, right? Oh, they have the handheld ones, though. You're talking about the people at the Mac store. At the Mac store. Yeah, Sorry. So cool. Let me clarify. You know, you're just walking around. I'm walking around. Don't drop my computer. Work. And of course, this is a total chick magnet. <laughs> no? What do you think? You just need the glasses and yeah. the... Yeah. I mean, who who would not want you? What a conversation started. Excuse me. You couldn't help but notice. Okay. That's the uh, new 2.6 gigahertz uh, <laughs> Centurion 2 Mac, MacBook Pro that you've got there. Wow. That's some <laughs> That hardware. is a girl after your own heart yeah. right there. Yeah. Hey, is that a MacBook 13 inch in your pocket or are you pleased to see me? <laughs> oh, God. So maybe keynote, like if you're watching keynote speakers, stand in a room only, you want to take notes. 
Per blogging. Blogging, oh, and, you know, while blogging you're... Blogging know, would be great. Podcast around, Expo. Yeah. You know, what, what, if you're standing around at something, and mm -hmm. it's, it's, you know, it's pretty comfortable. It's kind of like got that, like, gun, you know, it looks like a backpack thing on the back. Uh-huh. Yeah. You know, I'll, you can even turn it around and actually show your product and walk around and be a walking billboard. Walking Whatever your product billboard. is, it, you, so, flip it so around. So what you're saying is you put it on this way. This might be a great way to do registration. Okay. You know those people that have, they pay for the advertising on their forehead or their bald head. They'll put, have you seen that? Yeah. The new advertising? There you go. Pay someone to walk around. Meet people are going to be like, what is and that? This, uh, I bet you it's a lot cheaper than those big contraptions. It beats the monkey suit. Hi, would you like to receive my newsletter? <laughs> go ahead. Put your email in. And, uh, you know, you know, we should try this at the next show we go that to. That is really we funny. We go to these shows all the I time. I do. That's a great idea. Just have the video running right there. Uh -huh. Have someone walk around with it. Beautiful idea. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Uh, what do you think, Tiff? Um, I, you know, as long as it has a strap on it so it doesn't slip off during the whole thing. So you, you, you'd like to have some sort of way to secure? It, it needs security. Uh, That's for sure. Let me help you. Get that off without pulling my microphone off. It's a lot easier when you're <clears throat> trying to... And uh, I, I think it's a kind of a cool marketing thing. Oh, you like it. You know, I wouldn't say it would be, a, you know, used any... That marketing is all I can really think of how it would be used. Yeah. Or standing up. So you what know. do you give it? Um... Uh... Probably three out of five. I, I like the idea. I think it's kind of neat, but it has to have a strap. I give it a three out of five too, because yep. not only does it need to have a strap, but it's also not so superly built. I mean, it's also not terribly expensive, well, but yeah. you know, it's just rivets. I mean, and, and I don't know if you can see it here, it's just like bare screws and rivets. And stuff. Well, it's gonna scratch a little right here unless you have some sort of Yeah, exactly. So you padding. Want, and this is just a sheet of plastic. So it's, you know what it is? It's like a, it's like a prototype. Oh, exactly. It That's what like that reminds prototype. me of. Mm -hmm. Not quite baked. Mm -hmm. all the way yet. But I still think it's a great product. So that's three yeah. out of five for Tiffany, three out of five for me for the connected desk laptop holder. Six out of 10. Not too bad. Not too bad. If, if, if you're the kind of person that needs to walk mm -hmm. around with a laptop, I think it's a great solution mm -hmm. for you. Or marketing. That's all the time we have for this week. Uh, but uh, if you have a second, drop us an email. Would mm -hmm. you ever wear this? Would you mm -hmm. ever use this, something? Have you ever done anything more geeky than than that. Yeah, that's a, that turn you on? That's a know. very great, <laughs> huh. that's a great question. Yeah. <laughs> uh, send us an email, www.neo-fight.tv. And that's all the time we have for this week. Mm -hmm. Thanks for joining us. Yeah. And if you have an extra 30 seconds, take a look at this. Hey, I'm Andy Walker. Have you just bought a new computer with Windows Vista on it? Or maybe you've got an old XP computer that you upgraded. Well, we've just created an amazing new DVD. It'll teach you everything you need to know about the new operating system from Microsoft. It's called Getting Started with Windows Vista. In this DVD, there are three sections. One is out of the box. What do you need to do as soon as you start up Vista? Number two is Vista Essentials, things you need to know every day to make a computer experience amazing. Antivirus, security, all kinds of new features that Vista offers. And finally, geek tips and tricks, things you need to know that nobody else will have told you to make you a Vista guru. For more information, check out our website at gettingstartedvideo.com.